It is the end of November, the smell of decaying leaves and smoke permeating the air. And then the smell of snow comes. It is the first snow of the year. I love the world after the first snowfall, don't you? There is magic in it, children's delight, sleighs, holiday carols and wonder at the earth looking so different all of a sudden. It transforms from a warm palette artist into a pure white observer. The surprising discovery of me being a hybrid, as sort of a third culture adult who doesn't fit anywhere and fits everywhere at the same time, prompted me to start this whole channel. A lovely YouTuber opened my eyes to being a third culture adult. I will reveal their identity in a later video. So who is a third culture adult? A square peg in a round hole comes to mind. The term third culture kid and um, consequently third culture adult was coined by an American psychologist who was observing kids of American missionaries and diplomats who actually did not identify with their American culture when they came back. So children born in cross-culture marriages, children of expats, adults who have lived their life in a country or culture other than their original one, do not really identify with their birth culture so much. You know, they say 80% of the problem is solved by just becoming aware of it. Well, it's true. As soon as I realized I'm a third culture adult, I feel at home and foreign everywhere, including my birth country. I felt peace and I guess validation of my feelings the knowledge that there are tribes of people feeling it gives me the sense of unity, community and purpose. We don't like to be alone in our suffering or joy, do we? This shouldn't be such a big deal, but it is when you constantly feel like you don't belong in the place where you currently live. There are so many phrases in the English language which illustrate this feeling. I'm a square peg in a round hole, a fish out of water, an ugly duckling. Who wants to feel all these things? However, life always begins with one step outside of your comfort zone, a wise person said.